How's our mead? Krista, how you holding up? I'm okay. Vernon did what he could for our mead, but he's got a real infection and he's burning a hell of a fever. I'm worried if we don't get some real medicine in him soon. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Let's get the bad news out of the way. Yeah. <laughs> bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because, from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. That's my style. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. When did I get a map? I think I could lead us through oh, so to pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep the supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about a sneaker. it before, <laughs> just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. What do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. You just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. <laughs> of course it is. Can I go exploring now? How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better. To get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? Well, I don't want anyone else to die. Take that risk because it's just as dangerous not to. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what? <laughs> you said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. 
That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Mm. I don't think I'll find them in Crawford, sweetie. Why not? Because they're good people. And Crawford is a bad place run by bad people. I don't think they would have stayed in a place like that. How do you know they're good? You've never met them. Because you're good? Raised you did ah, Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Can't I come with you? Oh, that's a big decision, I bet. Crap. I'm good. Oh, Mead needs you. I feel like a terrible person. Oh, me needs you. What? Because he's like, what is he, delirious or something? Oh, did I make the wrong decision? Oh, this is so complex. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30 footer. So? So we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. I thought you ought to know. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us, huh? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess so. Then what are we waiting for? Sure. Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. See? Exactly. Own. What should I do if something happens while you're gone? You could do this, Clem. I trust you. Here. I want you to take this. You remember how to use it, don't you? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So if anyone tries to get inside the house that isn't one of us, if something does happen to Omi... I know what to do. Let's get you a You got this, Clem. Now if I do the three knock when I come back, that means it's me, right? Let's get this over with. That's a tiny little tool. <laughs> Look, I guess where we're going, there's not really a lot of walkers, so I think we're fine in that regard. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet. We stay hidden. And we stay together. We find what we need. Get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? Good. You can't get a good look above with the cover on. Well, of course not. Because you gotta remove the cover. <laughs> oh, we're in the street? Oh, that's good. Let's go. Is everybody? You should be gone. It's patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange. Is it? Do they know? I, think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kitty will sneak up, trying to take him out quiet. The 
Just if you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, kidding, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Yeah. Right behind you. Was a walker. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, Get inside fast. So there's no, there's no more humans. I, you know, I actually kind of called it. I figured it'd be a society that died out or whatever. Because everybody got too old. <laughs> Unless it was just recent. Fuck. Fuck! Do you think they saw us? Your guess is as good as mine. Shit! What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Man, we are so screwed. Ben, calm down. No, this is good. Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than our guards. True. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do we even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. Oh. Right. Follow the leader. <laughs> I got a bad feeling about this. That's the one, isn't it? Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. Okay. <laughs> sure. Go into an empty room without checking it out first. Oh, because it's a closet. Oh, no, that's a door. Is it a door? I guess it is a door. Armory. Okay. Figures. Locked. It looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Huh. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Here. Give me a sec. All right. Any idea where we could find a battery? Maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. Oh, right next to each other. That's convenient. How do you know that? That just makes sense, doesn't it? 
What about the fuel? Where should I start looking? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Okay. I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone cool. Be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Wait, what was I doing? <laughs> okay, fuel, medicine, we got the battery. Sounds pretty straightforward. Hopscotch. <laughs> Hopscotch. Oh man, a game I never played. At least with other people. I played on my own and then I had weird looks given to me when I played on my own. A globe? I have to wonder what's going on in the rest of the world. That is true. Is it only in Atlanta? It's just a bunch of paste. Oh, it's those symbols like again. Quite a system here. Perfect final solution. Number of il ineligible citizens found. Number of walkers found. Number of citizens brought to Crawfield. Oh, initials of person conducting search. And days since outbreak. Does that say 71? 71 days. So this society went to crap in just over two months. Is that what I'm getting? I mean, the starving boy up in the attic, that kind of makes sense. But this society that's supposedly really good just died? Ooh. Well, just a little bit creepy. I might come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. Lee, I don't think we're going to go on the boat. I think Clementine really does not want to go on the boat. I'm going to make the decision to not go on the boat and let some other people take it. But wasn't there something else to look at over here, I think? Like this map? No, the but... The Georgia State flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Well, it's not really history. It's history that we have now. <laughs> Nothing but crayons and construction paper. So according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office. And the battery will probably be at the auto shop out through here. Hmm. The fuel's in a shed across from the playground. It's just outside the stairwell. He said the entrance to the armor shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. And if we ever find medicine anywhere, that would be the place to look. Anything else? Nope. All right, let's go speak to Bet. Oh. No power. No TV. <laughs> no power. No TV. Darn. All right, Ben. Gotta keep it cool, man. Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just, just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? You're plenty useful. <laughs> yeah, right. It seems like all I ever do is get us into trouble. Well, I'll let you get on with it. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Come on. This again? 
It's my fault Dr. Nkacha got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. I agree. I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Business. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, he's gonna lose it. Then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it, but it's not now. Exactly. Not yet. And not in the middle of the danger zone, dude. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. You asked for my opinion, I gave it. Take heed. Isn't that the expression? Uh, how are things going with that door? Slowly but surely. All right, let's go to get the battery. Alma, check your battery. <laughs> if you know that reference, you are an amazing person. <laughs> if you know that reference.